doubters to believers. Thank you, Jürgen, for your amazing service at our football club over the past eight years. In that time, you made the impossible possible. That European night under the lights at Anfield against uh, Borussia Dortmund, where Liverpool won 4 3 in added time. Jurgen then led us to our first Champions League final in 2019 for the first time since 2005. In that run to the final, we made a historic comeback against Barcelona after being 3 0 down in the first leg to then win 4 0 at Anfield thanks to a corner taken quickly by Trent Alexander Arnold and finished off by Di Bocarigi. Jurgen also led us to win the Super Cup in 2019 against Chelsea as well as winning our first ever FIFA Club World Cup uh, in 2019 against Flamengo. Jurgen led us to our first Premier League title in over 30 years, the run running back to the 1990s. In the run to win our first ever Premier League title, uh, we finished 18 points above Manchester City, finally finishing the season on 99 points, which is an amazing achievement for not just the fans, but for the football club. Jürgen led us to the Carabao Cup final in 2022, known as the Kelleher final, as he scored the winning penalty to win us the cup that year. Jürgen led Liverpool to their first FA Cup final uh, in 2022 uh, since winning it for the first time in 2005 against West Ham. So that's a, another amazing achievement for not just the fans but for the football club. Jürgen guided Liverpool to the Community Shield final which was against Manchester City. Uh, and Liverpool came out 3-1 winners in that game uh, and that was a crucial game just before the start of the new Premier League season. Jürgen then led Liverpool to the Carabao Cup final once again in 2024. This was Jürgen's last trophy as a Liverpool manager. So it is a heartwarming one for us Liverpool fans after hearing the news that he was leaving at the end of the season. I'm so glad that Jürgen is a red. Thank you Jürgen, you'll never walk alone. I'm so glad, baby.